All right, welcome back to more Black Ops 2. Salazar, get it's it Same open. level. What we got here? Oh, flak jacket looks like. No, okay, this is a camouflage. Oh, I feel like Predator for Enemies optic systems. We need to get our techs working on analysis. Holy Son shit. Well, there goes my camouflage. Jesus Christ, come on. This front's too tough. Spread out. Clear the area. Black jacket would have been a little bit better for that. No, 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 no. I'm not sure what year this is. I know this game is kind of spread out over different time periods, but this is obviously the futuristic one. It better not be like some 2012 bullshit, you know? Okay, that thing's good. No, he's good, he's good. I keep shooting podcasts. Oh boy. The hate comments are about to roll in. Whatever, really. Just a little his like my history with Call of Duty, I back in the day I, I would play Call of Duty 2. I did that a lot. The multiplayer for that wasn't too bad really. But then uh, three kinda wasn't all that great, and then four is what really set the multiplayer online from like Infinity Ward did a fantastic job with four. Campaign was solid, everything about it was just a great game. And I I personally did some Call of Duty 4 stuff. I wasn't bad at the game either, it's just now if you get online, it is Hacker City. The moving fast, the just all sorts of stuff. Look at this guy's leg. Look at this guy's leg. That's just unacceptable. Let me reload everything. I'm being a silly bitch right now. That is actually... Oh. But yeah, Call, Call of Duty 4 was like the first one to really strive on the multiplayer uh, to that level of competing with. I think Halo 2 and Halo 3 were like the top, top online player games for a long time. On, on console at least. I'm not sure why I'm giving you guys a history lesson. Probably don't even give a fuck about any of that stuff. Oh shit, oh shit. Come on, extended mag. Really? It didn't pop out at all. Just, just a little bit. Come on. There you go. Let everybody else get here. Let me run around and see what the ammo everybody had. Scorpion. I'm not sure about that. God, there's so much stuff I want to try. I'm gonna stick with this for now, and then we'll, uh, we'll try the other stuff later. Ooh. Oh fuck. Look at that. Target the I know I got some grenades. I'm using them. Hang on. That's not even grenades. Never mind. That's that's a whole different thing. What is this thing then? That is so sick. All right, let me use the extended the extended mag. It's like a hybrid of an AK-47 looks like but it's got the recoil of like a I don't know what it is. it's got a really good recoil Push through them. just so you guys know I am playing this on uh, the regular difficulty not the easiest not the hardest there's four different difficulties there's like recruits and there's this one which is a regular and then I don't know the other two I know the last one's veteran Am I the only one, like, this is only if you've played it on console, on 360, but I'm just comparing the discs. Am I the only one that after playing, like, the past few games have been, the campaign is on one side of the disc, or it's it's two discs, you know? Like, Medal of Honor Warfighter had to be on two discs, because the graphics just were too good, I guess. It's not all about graphics, I don't understand why they do that. It wasn't a bad game, it just... You know, this is all on one disc, it's nice, it's, you, know, you gotta go change this stuff. I wanna play single player, well, I do that. Okay, we're clear. I don't feel clear. Look at that thing. 
What we got here? That's the same thing I've already got on this other side. Just it doesn't have an extended clip on the other one. This is 3D fabrication tech. Weapons, components, armor. Menendez is arming himself for war. Well, Woods told us how much wealth Menendez built over the years. He's been investing it in weapons tech. Somebody's here. <laughs> Does he just follow me around, I guess? Let's see if he comes this way. Maybe the camouflage is where he can't see me. Come here. Come here, R2-DT. What are you doing? Oh, my God. Let's see what we got hidden in here. Please, don't hurt me. Okay, come on out. This lab is linked to a known terrorist. You start talking or I will hurt you. My name is Eric Briner. I'm a magnetometrist. Yeah? And what is uh, Menendez's interest in you, buddy? They brought me here to process the solarium. It's a new, rare earth element that will render all existing microchip technologies obsolete. They're coming. Get me out of here alive. I'll give you everything. Down! Here they come. Oh, oh, never mind. Here they come. I was looking at the door over there. Supposed to get this guy out alive and. Shut him down, discover! You need to stand next to those. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. This is the wrong one. There we go. This is actually part of the objective. So you just sit on the ground like that. That's that's a nice little feature. You're on my side. Remember that. That is so useful. That's like some... Why didn't I think of that bullshit, you know? Planting shields in the ground. Oh no, you don't. Now where's the solarium? This way. The locking mechanism requires two operators. On your go. I'm not I'm not gonna give up this shield. It doesn't really like replace anything, so why not carry it with you? Follow me! Quantum entanglement. This single device has more processing power than your entire military infrastructure. Rumors around the lab were that Menendez plans to use it as a basis for a massive cyber attack. I, I heard talk of something called Karma. It may be the, the name for the cyber weapon. If Menendez uses a solarium worm to initiate an attack, there will be nothing anyone can do to stop it. Darth Vader just grabbed his neck from a distance. Harper, get a sit rep on the support team. Harper requesting confirmation on extraction team ZTA. No, it's got position. that. I'm about to say that'd be really handy, but it also could backfire. Damn it! No response. No, we'll fight our way out, with or without support. This ain't over yet. Probably gonna put this down somewhere and leave it there. I don't really need to carry it with me. Come on, can't plant here. There you go. That's kind of an issue I can see. You really gotta know what you're standing on at certain points. Yeah, through the wall, bitch. Fuck these chairs. That's swinging. Look at that. Yeah, I don't want to spam you guys with these videos, but when a new game comes out, more people want to see it than, I guess, average. 
And, uh... So I might upload a lot of this, but I do want to mix in other stuff so it's not just a constant stream of just one game, you know? But, I mean, I really appreciate all the support. That dude got fucked up. Let me, let me change weapons really quick. Let me just try this one. Scorpion's been around since, I think, Call of Duty 4? It's the first Modern Warfare, if you would. Center. Your team can stand out. It's Briggs! Stand out! It's the extraction team! Boy, are you a sight for sore eyes. I guess we can call this mission accomplished. Admiral Briggs, good to see you. You too, Sergeant. Whenever Menendez is planning, Solarium is the key to it. He's just a man, Admiral. He'd like you to think he's something more. But he ain't nothing but a sad old pitiful excuse of a man. 